Hello everyone, I hope you're having a fantastic day. Today I wanted to talk about the new behind the scenes look that the Twitter account for the Wheel of Time just released. It's only 36 seconds long, but it's full of interesting stuff and I wanted to talk about it. If you haven't seen it, you can go over to the Twitter account for the Wheel of Time and take a look at it. And let's jump into it. Action. Here we have the Waygate. We've seen this Waygate many times. The first poster for the show had Moraine walking through it. And I think it looks pretty good. I always thought Waygates on the books looked more like a door. But this looks more more mystical, more, more fantasy-ish. And I'm very happy with it. I think they did a pretty good job with it. And then we have what I think it's the Borderlands. And if it if this is the Borderlands, that will make this this army the Shinaran army because it's the only Borderlander army that we see in the first book. And here we have the White Tower with Lan, Moraine, and I'm pretty sure that's Alana. And one thing I wanted to point out, it's the set design and the costume design. So far, it looks incredible. I think they paid a lot of attention to it, and I'm very happy with it so far. An epic world of fantasy and, and the Hall of the Tower. We saw this in the teaser trailer. I think it looks small. I always pictured it more like a, like a bigger room that could hold a big audience but this this definitely looks smaller and here we have a scene with uh, who I think it's Perrin and Nynaeve with uh, some boats with candles on them which makes me think that this is after the attack on the two rivers and they might be paying tribute to all the people that died on, on the battle. Extraordinary ability. And here we have the White Cloaks, our first official look at the White Cloaks. Here we have the White Cloak banner. And I'm pretty sure this actor is the actor playing Amon Balda. Now here we have Randall Thor in what I think is my favorite cursed city in all of fantasy, Shara Logoth. It looks like a ruined city, which makes me think is Shara Logoth, but I could be wrong. Power. And here we have Moraine doing some magic. I think this is during the Battle of the Two Rivers on Winter Night. And this scene, having seen the teaser trailer, I think this scene is a different scene from this Moraine one because this thing looks like a chair that is flying this right here and the person flying and in the teaser trailer we saw when Loghain escaped from his cage he unleashed the one power and there were a bunch of Aes Sedai sitting around him on chairs which makes me think that this is from that scene, Loghain escaping. The whole world. It looks like right here they're about to go through the way gate right here. The Emmons Field 5, Lan and Moraine. And right here we have a merge roll. Merge rolls are looking pretty good in my opinion. We have a battle here. I'm not sure where this battle takes place. Here we have Moraine on a battle stance. That's the exciting thing about the series. And I think this is Nynaeve. And I'm not sure where this battle takes place. Now this, I wanted to talk about this. I'm pretty sure this is Tam of Thor. This actor looks like the actor playing Tam. And here we have some what it looks like some fruit on the background behind Tamal Thor. 
and we have uh, someone breaking into this place. Now, adding all of those things together, I'm pretty sure this is when Tam and Rand are attacked on winter night on their farm. And we're about to see maybe Narg right here. Our first official look at Tom Marilyn with his guitar. In the books, he didn't have a guitar, but I think this is a pretty good change. And Tom, I always pictured him as a old, badass man. But this looks a bit younger and looking very handsome. Pretty happy with it. Here we have Ewain and Rand. Haven't seen some pictures they released of these two characters. It looks like they're going to be on an actual relationship that is very different from the books. In the books, they, they had a bit of a crush on each other. They always thought that they were going to end up together, but they never really got together. Here in the show, it looks like they're going to start together as a couple. And uh, if the show makes us care about this relationship, it's going to be tough when we see them break up, which I think is going to happen. I don't think they're going to be together for the rest of the series. That would be a pretty big change. And intangible. That epic, epic braid. Just look at that. My god. That's a really good shot. I really like that. The really embracing Nynaeve's braid. Very happy with it. And here we have what I think it's the seven Ajas and Ewain in the pool. This is before they throw that paint that we saw in the teaser trailer. And this set, this set looks just, it looks incredible. I don't know if this is an actual uh, cave they found somewhere or if it's, uh, if it's the set design. They just made it for the show but either way it looks absolutely incredible and that scene that we saw in the teaser trailer looks really really good as well Nynaeve throwing away enough a cliff this might be for the uh, women's circle here we have Lan Moraine in the Emmons Field 5. And that's it. And there we have it everyone. We are very close to the release of the Wheel of Time. We've waited too long. And now it's almost here. Thank you for watching. I hope you're having a fantastic day. And I'll see you on the next one.